The birds have been singing, and the song is quite glorious. All right, these aren't exact quotes I'm throwing out there, but I'm paraphrasing some words that are, you know, probably most famous Nintendo insider at this point. When I say are, I'm just talking the whole of the Nintendo community. Nate the Hate, right? Last week, he put out these words in referencing that he has basically heard things about the Nintendo Switch 2 coming from Friend NDA at, you know, Gamescom, which for those who don't know what Friend NDA means, it basically means he has friends in the industry, in this case, game developers, that have been hearing things and talking things and telling him things from Gamescom. However... He's not going to reveal the stuff right now as a friend NDA is these are my friends and they don't want me to say anything. So I'm not going to at least not yet. Right. They friends will let them know when it's OK for him to share the information he's been told. But he put it out there on family boards in a very fun way. Just saying the song is glorious. He is sort of right, raising some people's hype. I didn't talk about it last week because, honestly, teasing that you know information but can't say information, look, it's nice for an internet forum. I don't really think it makes for a nice video personally. But, 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 today that sort of all changes because, well, guys, there are a number of people out there that know exact details about the Nintendo Switch 2 right now. And I'm going to tell you that dam that's holding back this information is about to burst and possibly burst in a way that maybe this thing just might get revealed this year after all. What? Let's talk about it and check in with this article over on Inside Gaming. So on Inside Gaming, you see Nintendo Switch 2 may have been shown behind closed doors at Gamescom. Guarantee that it probably was. At least that's what I've heard, but I, you know, I, I don't know any details on the system. And it was a new rumor has surfaced online thanks to Windows Central Managing Editor, so a pretty big name, Jez Corden. Now, Jez admits many, many times he doesn't cover Nintendo for a living or anything. He's obviously more on the Windows, you know, Xbox side of things here and there, but he doesn't really deal with Nintendo, but obviously has some industry connections. And Anyways, it says he tweeted earlier he heard rumors that a Nintendo Switch 2 may have been shown behind closed doors at this year's Gamescom event. Now, this is his edited tweet. We'll explain why it's edited. So he said, I heard some rumors recently that Nintendo maybe showed, maybe discussed, the new Switch behind uh, closed doors to select press slash devs at Gamescom. Full review slash leaks may be relatively imminent. Now, let's get to the rest of the article because Insider Gaming has additional details to add. Will that face value this could be another run-of-the-mill rumor? Insider Gaming has also heard similar rumors behind the scenes when speaking to its sources. Although we cannot pinpoint exactly what was shown and revealed, we know that Nintendo was at the event in a big way, allowing the press to get hands-on with Super Mario Bros. Wonder, for example. Insider Gaming is currently unable to verify the extent of what Nintendo revealed and whether or not it means a reveal could be soon. Almost all reports suggest the Nintendo Switch 2 is aiming for a release in the next 12 months, although we've yet to personally corroborate these details. It does suggest that a reveal could be on the horizon. Now, a journalist known as Necro Felipe, who runs Nintendo Universo, went out there and decided to talk about this as well. Necro Felipe, along with Nate the Hate, are sort of the two go-to Nintendo insiders most of the time, especially when it comes to some of this hardware stuff. They clearly have some connections, and he's proven right with information in the past. And he went ahead and quote tweeted Insider Gaming's tweet about this article and added some interesting context. So here it is in a different language. We translated it from Portuguese, and it says, not for the press, friend NDA official invitation. Essentially what he's saying is they weren't showing it to the press. It's under friend NDA. So what they're saying is game developers were shown this system. We're shown it off at Gamescom, not press. It's a clarifying point because Jez put out there that he heard press and developers. Technically his original tweet before he edited it just said press only. The press were shown it, and if the press were shown it, that means this thing's unveiled this week, right? But the press were obviously not shown the Nintendo Switch 2. 
But there was a lot of industry chatter and a lot of people backing up the Switch 2 was talked a lot about at Gamescom. And that, yes, it's highly likely several developers had business meetings with Nintendo to take a look at the Nintendo Switch 2. Anyways, he says, your source wasn't very accurate, friend Jez. So he's trying to be friendly with Jez. He says, I won't be reporting fully on this to Nintendo Universe yet, but this rumor is well-founded. So well-founded just means... According to his own sources, yeah, the Switch 2 was at Gamescom. It probably was shown to developers. It just wasn't shown to press, and Nintendo kept the two separate. So that, that's really what's going on here. Now, to add some more to this, just to get our additional confirmation, because look, you guys don't probably don't know Necre Felipe as well. I don't know him that well. I've never really had a personal conversation with him or interaction, but, but... We do have this stuff over on Fami Boards I want to glance at from Nate Drake. And you guys know that Nate Drake is Nate the Hate. And when you look here, he says, you know, he's replying to some people. Are you saying, are you hearing anything hardware related? I assume your bird song posts earlier were about hardware, but devs were the ones getting the detail, not press. And he says, I have heard things from Gamescom. So to be clear, you're telling us Nintendo hardware was not shown behind closed doors. And he says, I'm saying that Nintendo did not show press anything in regards to Switch 2, as the original tweet had mentioned. So again, this is all just clarification that Jez's original tweet talking about how press were shown Switch 2 was incorrect. The new modified tweet still referencing press shouldn't be referencing press. He added devs in there. I don't know what Jez heard, but I think this is one of those situations, and maybe for Jez it doesn't matter if he shakes the, 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 the hornet nest of the Nintendo Switch Rumor Reel because it literally doesn't impact his job, right? He is a top-tier editor for a Windows website, Windows Central, right? He's not hes not somebody who's going to lose credibility in the Windows space for shaking the Nintendo hornet's nest. But maybe, just maybe, he did hear some chatter from people in the press on the Nintendo side who had been hearing chatter from the developers at Gamescom. I think that's probably the chain of command it went to to get to his ears, and hence why he put press in the tweet, a little bit irresponsibly so. That being said, he shook the nest. And what is coming out of this nest is essentially confirmation Nintendo had the Nintendo Switch 2 at Gamescom. They were showing it to developers behind the scenes, answering questions, whatever they needed to do to probably convince developers to jump on board with this system. They also were showing Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Now confirmed, this is the first time we've had anyone actually confirm that Mario Bros. Wonder was being shown behind the scenes of press. I kind of figured that was the case. I had heard some things, but we, we've never had a public confirmation until now, and that we got that from Insider Gaming. But what is very clear is that the hornet's nest has been shook, and now... We got to see what happens. You see, the one thing that Nate seems really upset about is he, he basically noted that if anyone in the press now reports anything they heard from Gamescom in the next month, it's going to make Jez look like his tweet was correct. I think anyone with a brain can clearly look at the tweet and be like, well, none of the press are claiming that they personally saw it. They're claiming they have sources. Sources is not personal experiences. There is a difference. Anyone who's actually reading the tea leaves and actually reads the damn articles will probably be able to tell that Jez said Nintendo showed it to press. The press are saying they heard it from sources, right? So, like, you could tell. But when it comes to public perception, in general, fans will be like, Jez nailed it. If nothing else... As a Nintendo fan, as someone who's really looking forward to whatever Nintendo's cooking, it is interesting to see the hornet nest get sort of shook, maybe even bashed with a bat, but it didn't quite break. As I said, the dam holding back all the information is starting to overflow. And I don't think it's going to be long before exact Nintendo Switch 2 details are sitting in our lap. Maybe even just a matter of weeks. I am Nathaniel Rumpeljance from Nintendo Prime. All the sources are down below. Enjoy this bonus breaking news video today. Bye, guys.